Hey guys, I'm back, and I f feel like you may not have noticed, and I hope you didn't, but I haven't filmed in a while. If you're going through something, or you're going through some acne or some pimple problems, this might help you. There was this strange thing that happened. I slept after a really, really stressful day that I never really solved the problem that day and that night. So when I woke up, I had like a thousand pimples, like acne. And I had like, oh my God, what happened? And by August 4 or 5, it was really like full blown. Not only was I having some skin problems, I was also suffering a lot from hyperacidity and the hyperacidity was causing me to get some fever and I knew instantly it was like really tough times. Like it, it felt like it was under attack that it had to go armadillo mode. And I was, to be honest, really heartbroken about this because one of the things I love doing, although I never really earn from this, is making films and posting videos, editing them, putting on the music and all that, and giving you good, honest reviews. And I lost that because not only do I have really bad skin, I also felt so depressed. I had to make it go away. First of all, I cannot be depressed forever. I fixed what I had to fix at work and I also tried to do a lot of I mean I got help from a friend who has like alternative skincare products and I never have because of the job that I have right now I knew I never will have time f to see a dermatologist and I had to like really fix it by taking away all that bacteria or all that hormones I had to rest my body was already in a turmoil so I thought that you know I visited a doctor of course who gave me some meds to to prevent my hyperacidity and of course to handle my fever and also advised me to take some rest and not think about anything. So there. First thing that you do when you suffer from these things is to step back and rest and like clear your mind and be so hell-bent in thinking that you cannot be depressed forever. So what are the products I used to take care of the acne? I ordered from my girl Casa de Mori another tube of this but it's really out of stock everywhere in Japan so she said she found a supplier but it's gonna take about like 10 days and it's gonna be a little bit pricey because that supplier is also selling it to her for a more expensive amount so I said I mean you know this is my face I would rather spend a few more pesos in it anyway it's not too expensive from 1200 it became 1800 but i don't have 10 days so i said go right ahead and ship me this soap which is the kase soap it looks like a blue soap so i used this for about two weeks but all the acne were drying up but it only affects the pimples it doesn't dry up the surrounding skin and it's really amazing so why did I stop on my second week I noticed that it keeps on adding up more pimples towards the end of the second week and it never happened in the first week that's why I was like really surprised about it and towards the end of the second week I was also using this side by side with the Kose soap I went back to the ever reliable Kojic soap Kojic? Kojic? Ko Kojic? Kojic, Kojic soap. So this is the one that I use, which is pretty affordable. I've been using this a ton in the past because this is the one that keeps my freckles at bay. They are still there, but it actually prevents it from getting wider and wider or having more freckles. So the entire August, the first two weeks would be Kosei soap, 
it will be the Kasei soap and then after two weeks I use this during the time that I was already using this and this side by side I went ahead and ordered the pure white Shiseido I have a separate review on this product and I'm gonna link it below but this is the only time that I use this massively I ordered like 10 bottles so I have this this is the box of 10 and I ordered it from Casa di Mori because I really wanted the the pimple marks to like really go away because they were like really I mean they were looking really awful to be honest and I don't want to feel any more depressed than I already was so I was having the collagen drink and the pure white for the first three days just the first three days thinking that I needed more of like the collagen to like cure or heal or soothe my skin on the fourth day it's just the pure white and I went ahead using this until the ninth day so I would drink this before bedtime and the idea was to like really minimize the pigmentation that was caused by the pimple marks so I stopped after nine days because I got bloated it was also expensive because it was like 170 a pop if you want to fast track things I would suggest that you try this because it really tries to lighten the color of your skin even the undertone of your skin would look different and I particularly saw that in some of my photos where I appeared like really white so, I mean I've never been that fair and even my armpits were like really fair and I was like really liking it but I had to stop it because not only do I have just like one bottle left I also felt like the sugar and the sodium in here has affected my my body I felt like really bloated you can probably try the one in the tablet form which Casa de Mori also sells I just went ahead and used my existing products my skincare that I've been using like daily I went back to them I went back to the toner of the placenta cream and I went back to this lotion milk lotion from Hada Labo this one I use this one you need to use every day and every night and this one I use during the day because you know the makeup just adheres so well when I use this and also this is like whitening effect so that was really good at night my my toner of course my placenta cream toner and then this one of course my Hada Labo alpha serum which is my wonder product and the placenta cream on my under eye so that I make sure that my under eye is still like really hydrated on the first week of September I went ahead and bought 10 bottles of this just wanted to like drink it like every three days or two days just like really heal my skin I still have pimple marks you can still see them and this is under makeup I took a photo today and you can still see there's a lot of pimple marks but there's no more pimples so I mean there's no more new pimples and also another reason why I had to to, to stop the Kosei soap after two weeks was because I started having pimples on my neck everywhere that the soap would touch would have pimples but I went back to it on the fourth like on the fifth week which was around September I went back to the Kosei soap like using it moderately mildly like three four times a week only and using the Kojic soap when I'm not using the Kosei soap and it didn't come back I mean there were no more additional pimples I would think that my face was just so infected that time that it had to like really clean up my skin and so doing it actually made all those pimples come out so but now that I mean I've, I've healed myself I've relaxed myself I went on on short vacations like one day vacations I went on leave and I tried to 
to go back to yoga, go back to the gym. I noticed that using the Kase soap doesn't give me additional pimples at all. In some cases, people just continued using them for a month and a half and they had like a ton and then it quickly just went away and never came back. But for me, I don't have more than a month. I have a job that requires me to meet different people and I don't want to look like really pimple faced all the time so I stopped in my second week and I went back on my fifth week and so far this has been doing well and the, also another reason why I had to go back to the Kase soap is because the alpha serum will no longer be available yes it's over I don't want to be depending on just one product to make sure that my skin is clear I also used as a topical cream this Cashmin cream. This cashmin cream I use just on the affected part so I just put it I still have like this very dark spot here which is also a pimple mark and I use it on my jawline which still has a lot of pimple marks and I noticed that the next day when I wake up it it is considerably considerably much lighter so it's like a an attack on both ends where I use this as for the surface of the skin and the pure white was like from within if you're gonna ask me how I went by with meeting people for work going out hands down Natoractor I I don't know how but this product I haven't even hit pan and I've been like dunking into it I was like I'm so sorry but I have to like really go right into it and like put a ton because this is the only product that doesn't dry up. I tried using my infallible it has like really amazing coverage but it's too dry and during the time that my skin was like really flaking off because it was trying to heal itself I needed something that was a little bit more on a like moisturized consistency and this one is just heaven. I'm using the 151. I would use the Kamek BB cream if it's just like a few minutes or like doing the groceries. In most cases, I don't put on makeup. I just like stay at home and I go home early. I, you know, just try to, to watch some Netflix. You know who this is? <laughs> this is a cat from Viber. It's so huggable. So anyway, that's how I managed to like treat my pimples. Try your best to relax. Have good people around you. Talk to people you trust. Well, some of your friends may not be the right people to talk. Sometimes they just blame you for everything as well. But they're real friends. Trust, trust that they're real friends. But not everybody will be like somebody who will be good in like really consoling you or what. The best person to be there for you is yourself. You just have to have this frame of mind that you cannot be depressed forever and that you have to ultimately heal yourself. You have to relax, you have to take care of yourself, and you have to prioritize yourself sometimes. I would prioritize myself, but there are times that I forget and that is what happened. And I'm very glad that I have like people around me who were very supportive and I have Casa de Mori who has a ton of products that really worked and while I'm still, still trying to get over the entire pigmentation, there are no more additional pimples. What I'm going to maintain would be the Casse soap and the placenta cream or the milk lotion from Hada Labo. Also made it a habit to sleep very early, like 10 o'clock tops. I also went back to the gym. I've been doing a lot of kettlebells and body jam classes and yoga recently for the past two, three weeks now. The gym just makes me so happy. One of my friends told me that if there's anything that you cannot stop, it's the gym. You just have to continue being there, showing up, and because it makes me happy. I guess one of the reasons why I got so depressed was I stopped going to the gym and I kind of like really forgot about how happy it made me feel right after a class or two. I'm going to update you on the pigmentation portion. It's not over yet, 
so I'm gonna post another film sometime soon, maybe a month after, and I'll show you how I went through the journey of the pigmentation this time. So thanks a lot for watching. I hope that this film has helped you in some way or if you liked it somehow, please hit the thumbs up button. Please subscribe if you haven't already and I'll see you again in my next film. Bye! Sweets and two